current price of gas is four fifty nine in Orange, California on this full moon morning. One week ago or one week to go until the eclipse. Good morning everybody. We're in Orange, California. I have to go to work, so it's early. We're getting gas. Go gas pump. Bleed me dry. Actually, I got a deal. I got it down to 439 with my Ralph's fuel points. I hear somebody coming. Let's begin. Okay, so I'm still driving into work, but I went a different way because I had to go get gas and whatnot, but I saw this. I'm right by the Crystal Cathedral in Orange, California. Never seen this lit up because usually I'm here during the day, but wow, that is something. And then directly behind me is, in fact, the Crystal Cathedral. I've done a video on this and uh, that's not today's video, but I am an early bird and it is early. So I've got to say it is peaceful. Very cool. And somebody's walking towards me. So we're leaving. I also want to say that's a shot not often seen, the full moon right there. That is cool. So we made our way to the other side of the Crystal Cathedral. Just because, look at that shot. Still the full moon. The cross lit up in all its glory. Done a video on this like I was saying and you can check it out it's pretty cool I, this place is amazing but that right there you can see the staircase it goes all the way to the top of that this isn't too bad for a Tuesday morning I gotta say consider me thankful so yes it is now daytime still at work so it's time to get some lunch and this is what I thought would be a fun one to go over to Directly behind me is Holland Heads. Now this is a deli sandwich shop with just great sandwiches. And if you know about it, you know, but it's in Orange, California. It's right over here by the Chalk Hospital and pretty close to the Orange Circle and Disneyland as well. Not too far of a drive, but I'm gonna go inside and, and grab a sandwich. I love sandwiches. I'm a busy sandwich guy. So we're gonna go inside Holland's Heads. Then if you do swing by here, just know they're not open on Sunday or Monday and they open at 11 o'clock too so it's a little bit later in the afternoon but let's go check it out inside it's in this nice little strip mall too so there's plenty of parking they have the delirium beer but they also have and if you're looking for it um Russian River the Pliny the Elder and Pliny the Younger and I guess you know what type of sports team they they follow it's a Packers Headquarters and Hollingheads Highway. Plenty of bike parking. No pets. And they have trivia night here, Friday at 6 p.m. Let's go inside. So after all that being said, me giving you the hours and everything else, well, it's not 11 yet. We got like 10 more minutes, but that's fine. I work fairly close, so it was easy to get to. Um, I have no idea what I'm going to get. It's been a while since I've been here, but I'm looking forward to it. I, I remember they do an awesome sandwich, and somebody said before, the sandwich starts with the bread. So they got good bread. should be a good sandwich. I know their meats are amazing here. The sign behind me, I'll show you on this side. Look at it. Deli. I'll show you this side. Smoke. Hawaiian pizza. Smoked Hawaiian pizza. I think they're all individual stores, but let me name it. Deli. Salon. Cleaners. There's a store right across the way too, an old like, I don't know what it was. I think it was a drive through dairy, but we're gonna stop by there too and check that out. If you ever wondered what Orange County living looked like, well, here it is. and. I wonder if they're in the middle of painting this place here. It's 
It's an interesting choice. And they still have the slide windows. Look at that. That's like a lot of the beach communities, but like the vertical windows. A couple of people got the, the wall unit there. And then down here, Southern California. $5 gasoline and overpriced housing. Well, I guess they're open and you can see their Packers wall here too with all the cool like jerseys and stuff. That's awesome. A few players that have been here. The Minnesota Vikings cash for clunkers program. Packers train and plenty of German beer here too. And an overview of this place. So there's the sandwich shop over there. And they got the main like old school bar which is kind of cool and makes you feel like you're in the midwest but they have they have never seen that before pfeiffer's american lager looking for the classic ones the ones that would be from you know you can always get california so big on beers well everywhere is but i mean the german german beers so closter eyinger I won't be partaking in any beers, but, oh, there it is right there. If you're looking, this is the hard beer to get, the Russian River Pliny, and they do have it here. Doesn't have a price on it, or does it? I think they, they used to limit, you could get only two at a time. Rothhaus. Dark Barrel Ciders. Swami's from San Diego. The Schneider Weiss. Plenty of deliriums for you. Huh. That's, a, that's pretty cool. I would have been very happy about this place if I, if I I've been here before, but they would always run out. Okay, so you, you can actually buy that for 90 bucks, 12 bottles. I'll let you guys do the bat. Single cans of bottles are available for purchase. The corkage fee here. All the Packers signed footballs. Packers helmets. And once again, the bar. There's the menu too, if you guys wanna check that out. They got your mugs. If you wanna have your mug here, I guess you can get that. I'm gonna head over here and go grab a sandwich. That's kinda cool. Try to get the glare off there. My buddy Danny would like that. So I know it's hard to see here, all the different sandwiches that they have and you come up and you order up front. I'm gonna grab a menu so you guys can take a look and kinda see, and I already did the, um, what is it? The QR codes, if you guys want to ever check that out. I know that's kind of a pain. Here's the beer list. It's kind of hard to see. I really like this bar though, it's kind of cool. Really authentic. Definitely a place to come by and watch the game. Oh, here we go, they have the merch too. The Hollingshead Delicatessen. All right, enough of this, time to grab a sandwich. So they give you this card and spring breaks in effect. He was telling me, because he's working on the car here. Got the Legos out, the grandson's hanging out. So I went with, I'll show you in a second. This guy right here, the dragon, ham, salami, provolone, vinegar, oil, lettuce, tomato, onion, and pepperoncinis on a French roll. Hip squeak for kids and even myself. I enjoy a good uh, PB and J, but I'm gonna have to see next time about probably pastrami. Are those little hot sauces? Underbergs. Never heard of that. I see all this stuff and I haven't seen any Brett Favre stuff yet. What is going on? Oh, they do have, they have plenty on tap. 
Those gentlemen are good. Okay, so it says, redeem your underbird bottle tops for new valuable collectibles. It's bitters is what this is. So, for your drinks. It's kind of cool, I've never seen that. I thought it was hot sauce. Interesting. They call your name, or they call your, your card. I just, I think I'm next. I made my way directly across the street because it was so crowded over there and so many people are coming in. It gets a lot of uh, hospital traffic, a lot of the doctors and nurses come over for lunch, but I was hoping, because I saw this place was repurposed behind me, I was hoping that was going to be a coffee place, but no, it's not. Well, this is our sandwich. Look at that. This was $12. $12.99 to be specific. And most of the sandwiches there range from about 13 bucks to, to 20, all different types of bread. Oh, that's nice. And it's warm. I'm excited. Cheers. Oh, that's good. Now they say the bread is what makes it, and this is a, a nice, warm, soft bread. The flavor is just so, the vinaigrette, everything. So we're on Main Street right now. And like I said, Directly over there is Disneyland. <coughs> Bus scared me. I've heard it's been pretty busy because of spring break and Easter Sunday coming up, but wow, I'm a fan. I'll probably take this other half back to work. Hopefully get out of work pretty soon and head back home. I'm about an hour away from here, so I just want to say thanks for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you have any questions about this place, uh, send me a message or look it up. Pauling's Head Delicatessen in Orange. Plant petals behind me, petal plants. I think it's petal plants. Right there. That cool little building, building, little for sure. The plant store. I really wish it would have been a coffee because it's just, I'm just glad it's saved. Thank goodness. So, anyways. Mmm. Mmm. Thank you. Thank you. See you next time.